Greetings and welcome back everyone to another episode of Factorio. And as you can see, look, use your eyes and view into the screen, iron's dying again. And to make matters worse that iron's dying again, we're not making enough iron gear wheels to really fuel. I mean, I guess we kind of are because it's just going up there, but we need more iron gear wheel assemblers, and we also need more iron to be made. So, that means we're going to have to create some more electric furnaces, which we will make the six. And we'll wait till those are made. We'll make the space for it in the meantime, which is four, like that. Should be the four and four. Like this. And we need to uh, most likely boost iron from somewhere because iron is going way down. So uh, let's do. Oh, this is a tough one. I would say. Let's do, all right, well, let's check that train here has got one. So we need to spread out all the trains first. So let's get in, let's get in this one and we'll hop in and we will find out because this is empty and now these are full and we need to find out where we're going here. This one's going down this way, which the trains look so cool. I really like the look of the trains. They look awesome. All right, so this one's going this way, down this way. Look at that, that looks so boss. All right, we're going down over here, and this is going over to the area where we're double doing steel. Yes, it is. All right. So I'm gonna pause this train here for a second. And we are going to take these and fill them into the proper areas. So we're gonna take them. Which this one's out of electricity. Huh. Why they run out of electricity? Or how was it? Was it ever powered before? Not sure. But these are all done. So we'll pick all these up. And all of those. Take some of the oil later, and we're gonna grab these. And take them over in this direction. Curve it down here, and we'll take it uh, down right there. So down, uh, sorry, we go right there. Yep, right there. And we need some more stacking inserters, because these aren't really putting, well, now they're putting a lot in. So we need to make some stack inserters, which are here. And we're gonna need some more chests because we don't have enough iron chests. So we'll make some more of those. And we'll bring this one over here as well. Straight down, over again. And, oh shoot, down, over, like that. And we'll put the chests in the center. Where they all go there. And then we could just put these regular ones in here like this. But the stack inserters we should definitely put like that. And we're only really gonna have two for that side, but that's okay. Those should pick them up pretty quickly. And that should take that down. Oh, this is, uh, this one's, we'll join up on that side there. All right, so this one we can set to automatic. That one will go back. So what that means, is this getting enough iron over here? I don't think it is. I think we're taking way too much iron from there. Yeah, oh, this is finally done. This one here. So we can just get rid of all that. I think I picked up another robot again. So now we can get rid of that, and this is full of 
that so we can just make one that goes like this and we'll stick an inserter that'll continuously drop the rest of that. Oh, thank you for all the steel. And they're gonna have to wait. I mean, we do have plenty of steel, it seems like. Uh, but not all of them are running and we're out of power again. So power is another thing we have to focus on. So we're kind of flowing backwards slowly again. We might have to do something completely different. Look at all these parts coming towards me. This is awesome. Thank you so much for all of your stuff. And we'll gladly take it and put it to good use. Try and move closer to some of these. Okay, so that's kind of catching up with that iron there. I'll catch up with all these so they don't have to cry. Okay. So this iron isn't doing too well. Uh, our stone is doing all right. Because eventually we're going to have to make some concrete. Which I forgot. We're going to need some water for that. Well, oh, water's right here. Oh, so we're good on that. We could make concrete while we're over here. But I think our more pressing matter is getting the rest of this iron quickly back over. So we'll try and not get nailed by the... Oh, okay, another research. What should we research? Uh, defensive charge, we don't need that. Uh, inserter capacity bonus. Sure. We'll go for some inserter capacity bonus. And, uh, okay, don't get hit by the train. How much is in here? Not a lot. And these are mining out as fast as they can. Got to get more power grid up, which we should probably build some down here. Oh, my tank. We could probably build some way down in here in this area. This is, this should be another iron down here. We'll go down here and check. Oh, it's kind of frustrating that uh, this is getting loaded up fully. So we're kind of waiting on this train here is our big contender in filling everything up because this is pretty full with all of them there so it's our first car as well oh we didn't even finish uh taking the rest of this stuff we'll do that now while we're here so that way we have plenty of it and yeah, we'll just add all this in here and then we'll do the same thing on... Actually, we'll just go this side. Right like that. And then we'll add a power right there. And then we'll just drag it like that. And that should be fine. Pick that one up since it's done. And we our whole left side over here is done too. That's done, that's done, that's done. Okay, so this will fill up a little bit better. On that side, this will go to here, which maybe we should make some splitters to make it a little more even, which might help out. I'm actually going to make some splitters in the meantime, just so we have some. We have eight alien artifacts that don't really need to be in our inventory. This is getting full. Well, once this side gets full, it'll fill up to these other sides. So iron is doing... Yeah, it's okay. I suppose. It's not doing great, but it's it's doing okay. We just have to wait for the other cars to fill up proper. And then we should be able to do it. Please don't get it by the train. Okay. And we have our engines down here, which this is not really doing anything. We still have lots of piping in there, so we don't need to worry about that. Which is fine and dandy to me. One of the trains just went back. Here comes the full iron one. And it's going to go straight up. Or does it stop down there? I think it stops down there at that switch. Our coal is running out for our plastics. Which is a bit scary. So we should redo this area a little bit. Everything's starting to run out. I'm not sure I like it. Oh, thank you. Oh, look at that. Giving me all my stuff. Thank you so much. Thank you. Is there any... Extra robots that I have in my inventory. Yeah, I have four. Oh, whoops. Whatever. 
I'm out of regular robots, that's okay. Um, alright, now we're getting some stuff put in here. Not too many, though. What's in here? 1.6. What is in here? Uh, 50s and 18. So it's kind of pushing as quickly as it can. But it's still only doing one path going down here. And I just don't think one path is enough to keep it full. Well, it's doing pretty decent on keeping it full. And so is this. This is kind of putting... I don't know why this is here anymore. Or this. That can just do that. And that should be a little better. Alright, let's... That's full now. And now we're getting a little bit empty. So let's put the... Six we made in here. Oh, shoot. We'll put the six we made. Oh, it's always one off. All right, there's the six that we made. Extra belts. And extra belts again. And where are our regular inserters? There they are. And we'll put these all in. No, not double. And put those just like that. And there we... Nope. And there we go. And that should be a little bit better. I should at least push some more iron. This one's kind of waiting to put down iron again. So we should almost... I wish it wouldn't choose and it would just put it in the one place, but I guess it's okay because it's... Well, no, I guess it's only making that one iron at that speed, so we should be all right. Copper is doing semi all right. How are we doing here? A lot of uh, extra green circuits, but we're still making them as time goes on. We're doing all right here on making them. Placing them down. Actually, we're not making them. It is stopping every now and again. So it's not too great. And this is stopped up here because it's copper's not getting to the end of it. So we still are actually low on copper. So we might have to add more copper to this mix too. So we can make six more of that. And we'll add the electrical poles. I think it's the fact that we moved way too slow in progression. And now it's kind of just coming back to bite. And it's not good. I think we, we didn't move quick enough in our original thing. Which, I wouldn't mind starting over, because I have a lots of new ideas that I'd want to put into place of how to build new things and expand, and I think it'd be cool to start again, but I want, I, I need to finish this one. I gotta launch the rocket. Gotta do something. Alright, so there's some copper going. There we go. So that's another six copper. And we have, like, a super amount of iron. Look at all that. That's so much. It's almost the same as copper, too. It's so much. So we're going to need to edit this to change it to where it goes and flows down the other way. So it flows like this. Like that. So we can put some more space for these in here. We'll move this light over. We'll do three more assembly machines. And we'll do some inserters. Oh, no. I want to do them in the center. And some more like that. And, of course, we will make some iron gear wheels with them. And we got to power them up. So that will require... Oh. Some power there and there. And do we have some production modules? Sure we do. There we go. And there's not enough iron to make it all the way down to them just yet, but we have them there just in case there is. Because we're starting to run out of iron gear wheels to push... Where are we pushing them to, by the way? Ah, oh, we're pushing them to make these again, which we're full on that and full on that. And there's a ton in here. But those are being taken elsewhere, too. But red is kind of just chilling here without a purpose. And we'll put these alien artifacts in this chest. This wood needs to get out of my inventory, too. I don't need the rest of this wood anymore. Or this. Or this. 
or this coal. There we go. Take it all away. Thank you very much. We have plenty of blue science pack, though. Blue's stacking up pretty nicely. I'm guessing that's a good thing. But it's just uh, not that. So what else do we need in order to make the... What is that? What is this? Personal RoboPort. Oh, we already have that. Uh, what else? Night vision. So where is it? There it is. Okay, so we need 200 electric engine units, so we can just request those. So let's request 200. We need 200 of these. And we need 1,000 concrete and 1,000 steel plate, which I think I can request 1,000 steel. But the concrete we have to go make. So, let's head down and we will make the concrete. Because we won't really... I'm not too worried about this because we'll fix it when it the time comes. I think we'll just kind of leave it hang for now. We want to go work on some concrete because I think it's going to become too much of a thing to focus on and we're just going to be running ourselves crazy and not making any sort of progression towards the next thing so I'm just waiting here for all them to bring me some stuff and they can wait till after because I'm gonna walk over here now concrete I've never made concrete before so this will be new for me what do we need concrete concrete water iron ore ah uh. sad. I'm very sad. That's unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. So, guess we're gonna have to find some more iron ore from somewhere. Or find a place on the map where there's stone and iron ore. And Because I think that's iron ore up here. But that's not stone. Some iron ore over here, I think. Some more over there. Not much stone around here, to be honest. There really isn't that much stone. It's a cool little coastline, though. It's pretty sweet. Oh, crap. All right, well. What can we do? Well, it takes five stone brick and iron ore and ten water to make ten concrete. So, this is going in a passive chest anyway, so we can just make a requester chest, and we'll find some worthy iron ore to make it. Like, I think this iron ore is... Nah, it's gone. And it's gone. <laughs> There's still some iron ore here, which has 500 some. Um, Could we take it and steal it? How much do we need? We need one per ten, so a thousand divided by ten is one hundred. So we only need one hundred iron ore? Okay, well that's pretty simple. I can get rid of this, and I can just do one of these, and I'll go like this, and put this in a chest here. So that, oh wait, sorry, uh, there we go. I'll put that in there, and then I'll just request them. Do we have any speed modules? No, just production. So what we'll do is we'll go up by the water here. And since we have stone brick being made, here's some water. We'll make a pump. So where is a pump? Going all the way back to early times here. Uh, I think there it is, offshore pump. There we go. We'll make one there. And we'll just make it right here because why not? And we need to, of course, I'm going to make an assembly machine three. Because why not? Oh, this is going to take forever for speed modules. All right, you know what? Never mind. I'll just make an assembly machine two. It's going to take forever. Concrete. There we go. So water goes in there. Pretty simple. There's your water. We'll do a requester chest right here. And I'll put a stack inserter in there. And of course, we need the stone brick. 
and the iron ore, which is there and there, and that'll make our concrete. And hopefully that'll be great. There we go, there's some stone brick. And we'll put our, our passive provider chest here, so that way we can request the concrete to be brought to us. And I want all 1,000 of it. There we are. And power it up. It should be pretty simple. There we go, and how fast does this go? Oh dear God, that takes forever. Well, that's gonna take a long time. So I guess we're gonna need two to make some concrete. Well, there we go, there's 10. So that's 10 out of 1,000. Not too bad. So we'll add two. We'll make another assembly machine on the other side. Once we get the, once we get higher up with making circuits, we can make more speed stuff. So we'll put one there. Oh shoot! I need a, need that. Oh come on! I'm too close. There we go. And where'd the pipes go? And concrete. And out to another chest. Which doesn't have enough power, but that's fine. There we go. Alright, now we have two making concrete. Our water should be good. Yes, it is. Alright, so there's some more concrete. 54 and 60 so far. Not too bad. This makes 10, right? Yeah, it says 10. All right, cool. Nice. All right, thank you very much. So that should be absolutely everything. Just the 10K concrete we're missing. Nice. So now what do we do to launch the rocket? Well, we need plastic bars, solid fuel, speed modules. Jesus. <laughs> okay. So we need some low density structures. And that's going to be a little bit difficult to do. And also the solid rocket fuel because we don't have, is this selected? Well, I guess I turned it off. Oh, cause there's like no heavy oil. That's why I turned it off. We don't have really anything in order to take this Except for light oil. Can we make light oil into rocket fuel? 10 solid fuel. Uh, one light oil for solid fuel. Okay. So that's easy. So light oil is really in abundance. So we could take it and use it for some solid fuel production. That's not too bad. I'll just deconstruct an area around here. And I'll get rid of all this. And I think we'll just make some... Train going by. I think we'll just make a little solid fuel thing right down here. Because why not? We'll just take some pipe. And how far can we reach it down? Oh, we can reach it right to here. I'm going to do that. I'll just take the power and move it up there. And then I'll make one like that. And we can run it straight over to, we'll erase this, run it straight over to here. And we can make some solid fuel. Perfect. Which just requires some light oil. And then that will produce out into, which do we take that out with an inserter? Is that how it works? Yes, it is. So we can put that into a chest and that'll make some solid fuel for us. So we'll start with what, oh, I was like, what the hell is that? I thought it was some dust storm and I'm like, oh my God, I'm not prepared for this. <laughs> it scared the crap out of me. So we have some solid fuel going. Hopefully that won't be too bad. We have a good amount of concrete. We got 300 so far. That's excellent. We might be able to accomplish this this episode. We have plenty of that going. Petroleum gas is still kind of meh. Our crude oil is kind of meh. So now all of this plastics that's in here, which it's still loading it up, 
which is pretty okay. We're producing enough. We're producing enough here. Maybe we should... Let's start a second chest. So that way this will flow a lot faster. Start a second chest with that. Green circuits are still trying to catch up. So we're still not making enough of them. Uh, iron gear wheels look like they caught up a little bit, but iron probably hasn't. If we check out our production menu, I'm sure we can attest to that. He up consuming 2.6 and only producing 2.5. Yeah, that's that's figures. We're producing only 66 and making consuming 121 green as well. And only producing a little amount of red, I imagine. Red's not even on here of how much we're producing, and we're consuming a lot of it. I do 10 minutes, actually. Oh, oh, battery. That's right. Uh, we keep forgetting that we're adding a lot of things, but we're not exactly correcting the problem of... Correcting the problem of the power source. Is this still making things? Yes, very slowly. It's making some flying robot frames. Which is alright, we don't need anything too crazy. I'm, I have enough robots to keep me going for a long time. So we'll run back up here. And we gotta put some more of these down. We're running out of space to put them though. This... What was this? This is dead. Is this iron? <laughs> it was. Not anymore. Iron is dead from up there. Alright, so we need some more in here which I made this pretty crowded up in this section where else could we go we can go down in this way I'll make some robo ports oh, I can make four let's just make those four while we're here let's deconstruct these trees all along here there we go and all the construction robots come out and do their thing and we will make this RoboPort in line with some of the others. Hopefully, there and there should be okay. As long as it's... Oh, this one's... There we go. That should be okay. Well... Nah, I want it... Like, I don't want it... I should have it there and there. Oh, no, I want to have it a little closer. But it's going to be off. Oh, well. That's okay. And then we should be able to... I'm going to change how much this one is. I'm only going to make it two, I think. I'm only going to make it that much. And we'll see how that works. And we'll add another grid of these. Hopefully that will fix some of our power issues. It's not going to fix all of them, that's for sure but it's going to fix some. And then the same thing on this side, we'll make enough space to walk and we'll add a whole bunch here. We'll deconstruct all of this. And where'd our blueprint go? We're gonna be just inside the construction area, which is fine with me. There we go. Oh, <laughs> we gotta get rid of this copper. I forgot. Alright, and that should be okay. And there's iron and copper up here, which maybe we'll take really quickly and we'll mine a whole bunch of it out. That way we can have it. We have one solid fuel that we can put in storage somewhere. Alright, there we go. There's some more panels and stuff going up. It should be fine. And bringing me a whole bunch of steel plates. Thank you very much. All of the, all of the things. Thank you. And there we go, putting down a whole bunch of those. And how is power looking now? 147 megawatts. Which we're probably going to run out of power today. Again. Since these didn't exist. And we're going to have to speed mine this out. We'll continue going off to the right hand side here though. So we will get rid of those as best we can. Perfect. So we'll put another one right in line in here. And come on. 
And so right there. So that way we can expand out to the left side. And we want to keep it in line up here. Oh, just, oh, it didn't have electricity because it wasn't placed yet. But now we can expand more over this way. And once those get placed, we should be all right. Oh, everything ran out of electricity. Or some of it did. 153 megawatts. Not bad. All this copper needs to be mined out and placed somewhere. Oh, there's too much to do. There's way too much to do. I think that will do it for this episode. And I believe it might be time to just take some time and do some upgrading on things by myself just because it's becoming a little bit tedious to run around and do a whole bunch of stuff that needs to get done like iron needs to be improved I need to double check on how that's all doing which it looks like all of the irons being supplied we're just not producing enough of it which is not a shocker so I that'll do it for me hope you enjoyed uh, if you have any comments feel free to leave them below and I'll see you guys on the next episode.